Hey, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. Now, again, I have another spreadsheet here. If you want this spreadsheet, if you want me to send it to you so you can keep it, send me a text message at 210-960-5771. That number only works if you text me and you live either in US, Canada, or Mexico. Um, that number does not work if you're international. So if you, if you want this, you can send me an email at buildmysportsbiz at gmail.com. That's how you get uh, this spreadsheet if you want it. Now, I'm gonna cut straight into this here. This spreadsheet is labeled lone wolf mode, all right? And let me explain what this means uh, first before I go into um, all the questions here. So this means that if you are dropped off in a city, no one knows who you are, and you are starting from absolute scratch, you have no leads, you have no contacts, no one knows who you are, how can you get clients quickly? right and when i say quickly i mean like if you're really persistent if you're really good at communicating if you're really putting yourself out there if you do the things i talk about on this video right no matter where you are in the world this works if you're persistent if you do this halfway it doesn't work if you do it 95 percent, it doesn't work you gotta go 100 percent with it this is why like no one's gonna do the work except you i can't do it for you Right? I've already done this multiple times for myself. I've helped multiple coaches, hundreds of coaches at this point, who've done this successfully in their city. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna start at the very top. Right? So the very top it says, why am I coaching? And really, why? Why are you coaching? Now, when I ask you that, and I'm serious when I say this, like, if you boil down to like the the exact root of why you're coaching if that doesn't make you like really emotional when you actually think about why you're doing what you're doing then you probably shouldn't be coaching kids and, and trying to make it a business because if you don't understand why then two years down the road you're not going to want to stick it out if you don't have a deep burning desire to help kids and that's just non-existent for you and you don't know why then you know no one's going to tell you why like that's something you have to figure out but that should be something you clearly write out most people don't write down why they're doing anything right you get really clear on this then everything else below this makes a lot of sense all right so next one is who has access to my future clients now this just requires 30 minutes to an hour of research in your area uh, and I'll give you an example because I'm in soccer. Because I'm in soccer, I can type the name of the city that I'm in and I can type soccer leagues. I can type soccer organizations. I can type recreational programs. I can type soccer clubs. Uh, and I could then I could go into all the schools, every high school that's in my area, public school, every private school that's in my area, um, high school, middle school, elementary. Uh, who are the other private trainers? in my area. I could go to coach up and quickly find everyone. I can go on Google and type in San Antonio private soccer training. I can find all of the competitors. I can link up with whoever I want, whenever I want, if I do research, right? What a lot of people, what a lot of coaches don't do is they don't take the time to like meet people in their area and establish themselves. They hide behind the computer and they wait for, for clients to come knocking on their door. Now clients, won't come knocking on your door at the beginning of your business. That's just not how it works, right? So you have to establish yourself. So this is why first you do all the research on who has access to, to my future clients, all the kids that I can be working with. Next one here is how can I demonstrate my training to them, right? Now I have other videos that talk about like how to put on free clinics and stuff like that. I'm not gonna talk about that here. All I want you to know here is, you know, if you are networking, if you are establishing yourself in your area, then you should be demonstrating your coaching and your training with either their organization or their clients, whoever. And this way you can get kids to know, like, and trust you, right? That's the fastest and easiest way to build your business is by like go in with a giving hand to an organization that already has hundreds of kids and put on a free clinic. Uh, or put on a paid clinic, it doesn't matter. Like, go to them, they already have everyone that you could ever wanna train, right? 
got to be really good with sales. You got to learn how to talk with people. If you don't know how to do that sort of stuff, then the only thing you can do is practice. All right, go practice that if you're if that makes you nervous. All right. And then next one here, all right, after you demonstrate your training with them, are you collecting data from everyone? So what I mean by that is, are you collecting parent name, parent email address, parent phone number before they come train with you? Now, if you have those three things, now you have like a real lead. I, I would not consider anyone a real lead unless you have their data. Even if you meet them out at the park and you put on a session and you give them a business card, that is meaningless. They're gonna forget about you in two seconds. They're not gonna call you. You need to come away with data from parents. When you have that, you have real leads that you can follow up with, all right? Which is the last thing here, all right? How am I following up with my new leads? What are you doing? Are you just waiting for people to reach out to you or are you aggressively and proactively reaching out to them? Are you offering them something? Are you selling them something? Or are you just waiting around, right? Now, when you do these things here, all right, when you answer these five questions, it, you get really clear on how to get new clients in your area to work with you, right? This will work anywhere. I've seen uh, last year, two of the most successful coaches that I've worked with, guys that are making more than $400,000 per year, right? You, you know why they're really successful? It's because they understand the first question at a very deep level, right? And because of that, it makes everything else, three, four, you know, the bracket three, bracket four, bracket five, bracket six, all of those things are very easy for them because they understand why they're coaching. They, they really understand why, right? And then they are really good at networking and demonstrating their program to new, client, or new prospects that don't know who they are right? And they're really good at collecting data and they're really good at following up and selling. It's why they're able to grow their program every month, right? This stuff is not easy, right? It shouldn't be easy. It should be hard. I can guarantee you your competitors in your city are not doing what I'm talking about. I can guarantee it. Um, and this leaves the opportunity for you. You do these things, your business is going to significantly grow over you know, the next three months, six months, 12 months. And, you know, if you really want to scale it up, uh, I highly recommend simply go to my website. You can go here. It's buildmysportsbiz.com, all right? And if you want to chat with me, you can click on this massive blue button here, <laughs> right? This takes you to a page where I explain what this call is about, all right? This is to help you get clarity. You book your call here. You go to uh, my calendar. Pick a time, and from there, you can book a call with me. I'll chat with you for 15 minutes on Zoom. Uh, that's not a sales call. And if you wanted to learn more about our programs, you can go to my website anytime, buildmysportsbiz.com, and you can go down the page, and you click on consulting options. You can watch this video I have here, and then you can scroll down the page, and that will show you the different options that we have. That's it for today's video, all right? You know, I, I know that if you implement what we're talking about here, it's you're going to get results, all right? But if you want more one-on-one -on -one help, go set up a call with me on our website. It's very simple to do. You can do it in less than three clicks. That's it for today's video. I'll catch you later.